Hello everyone, welcome all to AutoCAD Learning. In today's session, we will learn to draw a 2D Archimedean spiral. So, let's see how it looks like. So, we can see this is a 2D Archimedean spiral. It starts from the center point of a circle and goes by after several turns to a specific point. So, we can get us highest radius that is the maximum radius and the minimum radius of the spiral will be 0 and number of turns in this picture we can see this is 3. So let us go to AutoCAD now. So for the start as it is a 2D picture or 2D drafting our workspace setting we have to check the workspace setting and click on the drafting and annotation style because this is a 2D case we have to click on drafting and annotation style done the 2d spiral tool we can get it at the upper ribbon in the draw section just click on the drop down you can see this is the tool named helix it can create a 2d spiral or 3d helix so as we are drawing a 2d archimedean spiral we need this tool the command for this tool is h e l i x H E L I X is the command for this tool. You can click on the icon also or give the command. Just click on the icon and it will direct you to a center point of base. The direction has come specify center point of the base. We have to specify the center point from where the Archimedean spiral will start. I am giving it arbitrarily. You can give the value also. So I am giving here 27. 13 it is arbitrary value so after that it will direct for the base radius as it say specify base radius I can specify the base radius I am specifying it to 10 to a value of 10 given enter and as it is a agrarian spiral it will start from a 0 the center point so the end point or the top radius here it is specifying to be 0. Now it will ask for the height as it is a 2D's case. It does not have any height because this helix tool actually draws the helix cases that is a 3D case. So it will ask for the height but as it is a 2D case the height we have to give is 0. But before that we have specific properties here that is the axis endpoint that is not needed for here number of turns it is needed here and the twist direction is needed here okay and number of turns we have to click on the turns and give the number of turns to be 3 and just click enter our archimedean spiral has been done now you may ask that can we draw the 2d archimedean spiral in clockwise manner because we have done it in anti-clockwise manner yes we can draw it in clockwise manner also just go to the draw drop down section click on the helix tool give the center of the base point I am giving it here specify the base radius I am specifying the base radius to be 10 it is done and the top radius to be 0 it is done and number of turns click on the turn number of turns to be 3 enter and the twist click on the twist you can see CW and CCW CCW means anti clockwise and CW means clockwise just give the command CW or click on CW that is the clockwise command now give the height to be 0 so this is the Archimedean spiral in clockwise direction. So in this video we have learned about drawing a 2D Archimedean spiral in clockwise and anticlockwise manner and using a helix tool. So thank you for watching we will see you in the next video.